Hey everyone, Mayhem Prone here from the Mayhem Prone Show, where today I have lied to you. Last time I told you this episode would be about Pinkie Pie, but in the last few weeks, a few events have transpired, and now I have an even better topic for you. So let's talk about Applejack. When the show first began, my least favorite of the main six was Rarity, but around midway through season three, her character started to improve a lot. This caused a large fraction of the fandom, including myself, to change their least favorite of the main six to Applejack. But with the advent of the new episode, Applejack's Day Off, it showed me how to make a truly great Applejack episode. Applejack episodes tend to suffer from two different problems. First, they're usually too over the top. Applejack is portrayed as being the straight man of the group. She is level-headed, and her point is that she's an anchor that keeps the rest of the main six from going too far off the deep end. This makes it feel wildly out of character when Applejack herself is way over the top. We can imagine Rarity breaking down from the stress while trying to put up her boutique in Shadow Row and Wreck, but we can't imagine Applejack doing the same, it's just not her character. This kind of problem is most apparent in episodes where Applejack is teamed up with Apple Bloom. In these episodes, Applejack is portrayed to be extremely overprotective. This doesn't work for a specific reason. Outside of these choice episodes, she's never shown to be extremely overprotective. This makes these few episodes feel very odd because they show a different Applejack than we've seen in the rest of the show. With all of this being considered, I believe that with all the character building we've had, there's no real way to make an episode with Applejack being over the top that doesn't compromise her calm collective character. Now the second thing that tends to plague Applejack episodes is her pride. Now having a prideful character in and of itself is perfectly normal and having a few episodes dedicated to the pride is perfectly okay, but this trope seems to be in too many Applejack episodes. This problem isn't as prevalent today, but it was major at the beginning of the series. We had episodes from Applebuck season to fall with their friends all of major themes of Applejack's pride. A little pride is good, because it shows that all characters have some kind of flaw, but too much can make your character unlikable. Applejack is unfortunately the latter, and goes a bit overboard. If you go to the MLP fan wiki and go to the personality section of Applejack's page, they actually list stubbornness before honesty as personality traits. That's a problem. This is why Applejack's Day Off is such a brilliant episode. Applejack's flaw is that she wastes time and energy compensating for non-existent problems. This issue works perfectly of her character because it shows a legit problem that she would face being a farmer while not sacrificing her calm and cool demeanor. The episode also avoids Applejack's pride problem. The old Applejack would be unwilling to try Rarity and Twilight's ideas due to her pride of being a farmer all of her life, but this new Applejack is completely willing to try things from a new perspective. Therefore, Applejack's day off completely eliminated the two pet peeves that I have with most Applejack episodes. But what do you think? Do you think there are other things that could be done to make Applejack episodes better? Did you like Applejack's day off? Did you not like Applejack's day off? Leave a comment in the section below to tell me why or why not. The must watch pony video of the week goes to Golden Fox. He just made a video listing his top 10 favorite episodes of MLP season 1. It's an entertaining blast from the past with many interesting points. Remember to like and subscribe, and until next time, I'm Mayhem Prone from the Mayhem Prone Show, and goodbye!